able to stun and destroy. Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton, and I'm your humble narrator, and welcome back to Awesome Knots. Uh, today we are doing a victory with Coco, Coco Nebulon, oh yes. She's got that lightning ball of doom, uh, she also dropped some shit on the floor that's like slowing people down and DOT in them and all that. All that goodness. And uh, there is some really good team play in this match, is what I will say. We've definitely got it down to a science. I'm trying to lure this Swiggins at the moment. Hey, come on over here. I use my lightning ball. Oh yeah, get him! <laughs> and luckily Lone Star was able to save that Swiggins. I'll be back. I just need some health. And then, uh, yeah, that scoop seems to be just chilling. Just cold chilling. Nobody's making too many moves quite yet. Did nail that Lone Star. That helps. Oh, and that Voltar is gonna be just, uh, just terrible. I never like a Voltar. Ooh! But I did nail again. Uh, we're getting some pretty consistent hits with the Lightning Ball. Which makes me think this could be a good match. Oh yeah! Except I missed right there. <laughs> never mind, I take it all back. Everything I ever knew was a lie. <laughs> oh, but I do like the, uh, the synergy with Scoop's little ball, or little hammer, and then my ball combined together. Oh yes. What a good time. And there's some good uh, some good lane clearage by Froggy. Just uh, feeling each other out as it were. This seems like everybody's sticking together relatively well. Yeah, they're definitely all three together. So it's gonna be a, a pretty low scoring match as far as kills. But um, definitely high competition. Which I think is a good thing. A good thing to see. I definitely do like it. Uh, especially when you've got a team that's working together with a lot of synergy. Synergy! Oh yeah, Froggy got in there. I'm here. I'm here. Boop. <laughs> Had to time that jump a little differently so I could uh, bounce as the anchor broke. Definitely uh, pretty awesome. Wow, I almost died there. If somebody gets like more damage on the anchor or more uh, duration on the anchor, it can throw you off because you'll be expecting it to break in this time, um, which is something that I hadn't considered before. Reduced cooldowns and things like this do the same thing, uh, and it's it's a pretty cool thing to take into account, especially when you're in uh, some high level team play, which as far as I'm concerned this is because uh, Neither of our turrets have really been touched yet. We're all chilling out together. Oh my. I should get down there. Mm hmm. <laughs> yep, yep. That's for everybody. Okay. I saved some lives. Oh, damn. We were gonna pinch that Lone Star. That's alright. At least our scoop didn't get pinched yet. There is no first blood. Uh, but that's just fine. Gonna tear these droids up. Ow. Eat some fucking dynamite. That hurts so bad. Oh no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Let's do some damage. <laughs> Nobody gets away for free! I've got a slowing on Coco's gloves at the moment. I do like attack speed, slowing, and lifesteal. But there's really good options. Uh, more damage on turrets is really, really tempting. Especially if you have a Voltar or something on your team that can just give you uh, a little bit of time with the turret. You can you can be a pusher almost as good as Lone Star. Almost. <laughs> Not quite. It's hard to compete. But yeah, we're uh, definitely doing some big, some big team plays here. I was able to nail the uh, Swiggins and or Voltar with that ball from the bottom, which was really cool. Uh, I should probably save it a little bit for when um, Voltar drops his health bot because that is one thing that people are also thrown off by. Silence is also another thing. There's just uh, a lot of stuff that will knock you out of your rhythm in Awesome Knots and I think that's uh, one of the interesting things to consider when you're making your build. If, you're, if your teammates are extremely skilled, they might uh, look at your build and notice and account for it, but 
don't count on that necessarily. Holy shit, the Swiggins is so dangerous, man. I have to leave. Going home, going home. Should get some more damage on the uh, lightning ball. That is one thing that I really like. Um, I also like increasing the speed of the lightning ball. I usually drop Heavenly Fire for that since Heavenly Fire had uh, a damage reduction. Heavenly Fire basically just uh, makes your lightning ball leave a static trail. But now it does only 75% damage of the trail or something like that. So it's not as worth it to take it, but um, it's still not a bad option either. It's worth considering. Really all of the uh, upgrades are. I really, really like the, the work they've done on Awesome Knots. Oh my god, get him. Get him! Damn it! I should have waited just a second longer. Probably. Um, and then I could have at least got some, uh, some DOT damage on him. But I haven't bought the DOT damage upgrade for Coco quite yet. Um, increasing the DOT damage and slowing is probably something that I take every time. But then there's uh, the question of whether get, to get movement speed on your board. Or, um, oh, get that fucking, no, no, okay, we came away good, wow, wow, all right, time to push, time to push, time to push, um, yeah, getting movement speed or getting the, uh, the perk that lets the, the blaze stay longer on the ground is always, uh, an infinite question for me. Usually I'll go for the movement speed, but, uh, our team seems to be sticking relatively together like I don't find myself stuck alone wishing that I was able to get away so quick at least not in this match uh, not currently we're doing pretty good pretty killer and they just tore up that uh, that droid wave it went all the way to the turret for nothing oh hoo -hoo. that's fine we're gonna get this Voltar Boop. knock that health bot out that shit out of here. The fuck are you doing? <laughs> oh, 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 I missed the Lone Star. Uh oh. It's kind of scared of the Swiggins. But the uh, Zyka baby, Froggy, freed me. Thank you so much for that, Froggy. If you somehow see this video, you're fucking awesome. So's that scoop. We definitely have some good, uh, some good synergy going. Although it's not necessarily a team that you would expect to be like 100% awesome. Um, I mean, any team with Froggy and Scoop is kind of hard to, to say no to, but uh, I'm glad that I'm able to perform some decent cocoing at the moment. Oh, man. That's what I call snowballing. Good job, Scoop. Doing that fucking thing, man. I just kind of dropped down to scare the Scoop. Let him know. Them people's coming. I ju juke that Swiggins out pretty well. Um, really, the... The coup de gras would be uh, juking him out and nailing him with a <laughs> with a lightning ball, which I hope to do relatively shortly in this match. Oh, this shit's gone. This shit's gone. Oh, and I'm out of there with just no health again. That's so awesome. I have 460 solar. Hmm. Hmm. Can we go back in for a little more? Hmm. I could get a lot of upgrades. I really hope I don't die. And get him! I got something. <laughs> I think it was the Voltar. I like to think it was the Voltar. So, uh, now that we have uh, our movement speed upgrade for the lightning ball and cooldown reduction, that's the other thing that I like to get for it, uh, we'll be able to fire him off relatively fast and the lightning ball does do a massive amount of damage. There! There's the juke! <laughs> And uh, I was able to bonk him on the head with a lightning ball, which was super cool. I thought that Lone Star was going to come out a different way. We are definitely sticking together. I really, really like how uh, how on it both of these teams are. It's super impressive. Especially since uh, we're all doing solo queue, I assume. I can only imagine what it's like in League uh, 2 or League 1. I like to imagine. Oh my god. Damn it! Holy fuck, I missed! Are you kidding me? So mad. So mad, brah. And I I was able to chew up that Voltar uh, pretty hard. Not quite enough, though. Oh my god. I'm scared of Swiggies. I'm scared of Swiggies! 
That is some massive damage that he has on that hook. Of this, I am sure. I do want to kind of creep or at least wait around for a minute. That's why lifesteal on the gloves is uh, such a delicious thing. Really, lifesteal for anybody is nice. I like it for Scree as well. Uh, just keeping your sustain up, you know what I mean? Scoop's Binding of Justice. Oh my. I have to go now. I have to go. <laughs> yeah, we're safe here, I think. For now. But they're coming. They're coming to get you, Dayton. No, shut up. <laughs> oh. So far, like, yeah, no kills really for me. But the team has been performing well, which is the most important part. I just hope the kills that I get will be amazing. They'll be super amazing. I'm going to come up here and steal your creeps. Because that's what I do. They don't really need it because they have Voltar, but uh, it is an extra six solar if you kill both of the creeps, which obviously adds up pretty quick. And I was able to uh, shove that lightning ball in there pretty quick thanks to the movement speed increase. It is super small. I think it's only like 12% or something. Holy shit! That scoop fucked him up! Wow. Almost got that Voltar. I wish my uh, lightning ball was together at that moment. But no worries, I got the Lone Star to wait. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh. 34 health, holy shit. <laughs> Gotta go. See you later. Oh, man. That was dangerous. That was dangerous. Wow. Oh, and I ended up taking the fucking health bubble anyways. Derp. Not what I meant to do. And I missed that Voltar. No worries. Just gonna hang out for a little bit longer. You wanna hang out for a little bit longer? You and me, Scoop? We do have uh their turrets down, but they're they're not making it easy, unfortunately. Or or not so unfortunately. I'm quite undecided. I do like a, a five minute steamroll match, but these fucking like 30-40 minute matches are uh quite a thing as well. I I I find myself growing quite partial to them because whether you win or lose, at the end, you're just like, dude, that was a good game. Good game. I was able to nail that Voltar. Catch him with that lightning ball. Huh! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> There's my kill. Kind of swooped it from the scooped it. But, uh, that's okay. And, uh, yeah, that scoop did tell me. Nice. You're good Coco. Yeah, good Coco. And I just gave him a winky face. Oh, yeah, baby. I'm the best Coco, baby. <laughs> You know me, baby. And I juke that fucking Swiggins again! What? What? Ha! Ugh! Kill him! Kill him, Dad! Oh man. It's going so well. They're uh, not letting us push this top turret at all, which uh, is troubling. We're gonna need to do it, because otherwise you just get pinched off. And I know even uh, once we knock the top turret down, there's just that final push. That final turret is absolutely fucking crazy, uh, which kind of makes me like Serona. It's a really good map, but it also uh, is a little bit frustrating. Oh shit. Oh god. Oh crap. Oh balls. Alright, so uh, we're, we're back into the fray. One and one, I guess. God damn it. <laughs> but I'm gonna do my best. I'm gonna even up nice. Ooh. I thought I uh, broke that Swiggin's anchor as soon as he threw it, but it was not the case. Hmm. I think uh, now I have the conducting gel. I did not have it before. The ball seems to be moving slightly faster. But it is uh, definitely a good cooldown to get. Oh my god. <sighs> it competes with Lone Star's Dynamite as far as the uh, burst damage is concerned, but it has much more range to it. I like it a hell of a lot. Did I hit anything over there? I don't know. I just don't know. Once you get the conducting gel, it's definitely a good idea to uh, detonate the ball. Oh my god. Oh my god! Shit! So, droids took down their uh, top turret, but we also uh, lost our bottom turret, and they just fucking ate through most of the health of the top one. Which is really, really not good. 
There was uh, a low health Voltar in there, which I didn't see during the match, unfortunately. But that's just fine. I'll knock this rocket droid away. Buy some time for the, the creeps over here. Yeah. They were definitely uh, working on flipping this lane. Boop. Ten solo for Coco. I'm going loco. Don't hit the button. Don't hit the button. Boo! Boo! Kill them all! Yeah! Even that shit up. Two and two. That's much better. Much more acceptable to me. Lone Star's Dynamite's an interesting thing. Uh, I definitely prefer face dynamiting people to just kinda throwing them out there. It's not as reliable. Um, yeah, hence why Coco is a little more a little more tasty to me, but obviously not the same pushing power. Oh! Oh! Dude, I just pulled that fucking Lone Star out hard. Oh, and all these fucking dudes. Yeah. We are good. We are doing the thing. I didn't even realize I was dying. <sighs> yeah. Oh, two and three. We just seem to be a uh, one behind this entire way, but I, I calm myself by saying that uh, I'm offering some pretty good support. Oh my god. Yeah, just like that. Able to stun and destroy. Slow down that Voltar. Hmm. I'm not gonna go after him. He's got some uh, massive attack speed on those drones, and uh, it hurts. It just hurts a lot, so I'm not gonna fuck with it. If you want me to be real honest. Tear up these droids. Again, they're flipping that bottom lane pretty, pretty quick. I'm surprised what kind of quickness they've done with this bottom lane. And I should go up there, but I don't see any enemies on the minimap, so no worries. I'll just clear this bottom. Clear the bottom lane. It's my job now. Oh, they're they're dealing with the Swiggins up there. Oh, and they dealt with him. <laughs> they didn't need help from the Dayton does. Well, that's just fine. Good job. Good job. Tip of the hat, gentlemen. Um, are we through that turret yet? I don't think so. Got a little more to go. Just a little. Boom. Nailed again with the uh, lightning ball of doom. And it does such good damage. Oh my god. I love it. Ow. Ow. He has uh, knock away and explosion damage on those drones. The explosion damage definitely leads to some, uh, some big nastiness. Oh my god. I nailed everybody. No, Froggy. No. No. Oh shit. Oh god, it's so bad! I'm sorry, oh, I'm sorry, Scoop. Oh fuck, oh shit. Oh! <laughs> what? Ah, oh, I avenged the Scoop. That is absolutely fantastic. Drag him through that uh, electricity trail. And he did catch me, but guess what? I caught you too, motherfucker. <laughs> oh man. That is crazy. All right, so we're back up to three and three. We just have to be smart about it. Break all this shit up. And uh, yeah, this will flip it if I leave them. So pull them out a little bit more, just like that. Get these, get these droids going. You stay away. You stay away. Nailed somebody. No problem. <laughs> they are scared. The mobility of. Uh, Coco and Froggy combined with the stability of Scoop is really a force to be reckoned with because they can just kind of stand behind him and uh, lob out the damage, especially Coco. Froggy's just there for like, you need a quick stun? But yeah, I'm just lobbing uh, electric balls behind their turret. Oh shit. Save the Scoop. Uh oh. Hit some creeps. Everything's fine. Just don't want to die quite yet. Oh, and that does nothing. It does nothing! That's fine. Nail that. Ugh. I should scoop somebody out from behind the turret. Get it? Because Scoop's my teammate. Oh, God! Oh, shit! You guys are so tricky. Yeah. So, uh, I did go for movement speed instead of the extension on the blaze. Which I think is the right choice. Holy shit. Yeah, Froggy just saved my life again. Thank goodness for that young boy. That young man... Oh, 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 get him! Get him! <laughs> now he got away. 
But that was pretty good. That was pretty good. I know Scoop wants help, but I'm going home. Sorry. Had to do it. Mm, it's just a thing that happens. <laughs> ah. And uh, now some attack speed on the gloves, although it's quite late in the match. Um, generally, I don't find myself using the, the gloves on players anyways. You leave my froggy alone! Leave my froggy alone! That's right. I'll assist. Ooh, I think I nailed both of them. No. I didn't. It did nothing, because that Swiggin's got the heal. Oh, there we go! Four and three. That's so nice. Chew up that fucking Voltar. Oh, we gotta fucking finish this right now. Finish this right now! Right now! Wait, didn't you just die, Voltar? Am I fucking confused? Oh, now he died. Never mind. <laughs> this is gonna be over. So, friends, this has been awesome. Not some great, great team play in this match. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. Please don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy this episode. And if you do, friends, I'll send you a VCR. You can record things with it. It's kind of like a DVR, but shittier. <laughs> Anyways, I'll see you in the next one, friends. And until then, bye bye one, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.